We really do encourage you students to come by the welding shop to check out all the equipment we have. Uh, test your ability to welding. You spend more time in the weld lab and practice, it becomes more easier. So far, it's, it's an amazing experience for sure. We have the best uh, instructors and they taught us a lot. Definitely, uh, we deserve a lot of credit for that. We are more than just a college. Some say that we thrive off of challenges and failures, but we still have more room than ever to improve. In order to become the greatest of all time, we stick together and execute what needs to be done. We are more than just a college. We are a university. It begins from within.
My name is uh, Thomas Nimrod. I am from Kiantz, Arizona. My major is in the IT field. Well, I chose to study in the IT field because I felt it was a good field to grow in and uh, it's very uh, challenging and I like to learn about technology. And also one other thing was uh, the I like to know the security parts to help my people when it comes to um, like Facebook or any technology stuff, especially with the elderly and the younger generation. I would like to show them that technology is a good field to go into and, um, and prosper. I chose the tribal school, the well, NCU for a record. I chose it because my older brother came to school here and uh, he told me about this place, which uh, I want to follow in his footsteps. Not only that, I wanted to support my Navajo tribe and uh, get a better education than when they returned to my tribe and uh, help them. Well, the school really did support me, especially with the instructors. Uh, the instructors were really, they reached out to me and um, I was able to work out a schedule with them through Zoom and through Google Meets. And uh, with, uh, before we had Moodle, now we have Blackboard. Those are very, very uh, useful. And not only that, the student, uh, the school had me, gave me some money when I needed it, especially in a hard time with uh, food and uh, not being able to go any places. Okay, uh, this is really good because I've been trying to get my nieces and nephews to come to school here because NCU is full of opportunities if you really get involved. And uh, for the past year now, I'm a junior, I've been getting involved a lot more and a lot more opportunities have uh, come available to me, especially right now in this interview. And uh, this is like another opportunity for me. Navajo Technical University Culinary Arts Program, Baking, and Hotel Restaurant Administration Program. We provide our students with as many marketable skills as possible. We will cover everything from food safety and sanitation all the way up to classes such as Hospitality Law for the Bachelor's Program.
Hi, my name is Deanna James. I am originally from St. Lake, New Mexico, but reside in Crown Point, New Mexico, and I am a student here in the Business Administration Program. I am in the Business Bachelor's of Arts in the Business Administration Program. The reason why I chose Business Administration is because my grandfather taught me to hustle. My grandfather taught me to be more organized, to have time management, and he's the main reason why I chose the program. I chose a TCU because based on it's affordable, it's close to home, and it's where you can get the same quality education as a regular university. NTU has done a lot for me. NTU has helped me with gas, has helped me with income, additional income during the pandemic. The main thing is giving me the opportunity to tutor students during the pandemic from face-to-face -to, -face, um, to counter into Zoom. So NTU has done a lot. You can design your, your arrow to go beyond 50. I want you to look at the arrow all the way down. When I make my, my students shoot, we try to look at the arrow. We study the arrow.
We really do encourage you students to come by the welding shop to check out all the equipment we have. Uh, test your ability to welding. You spend more time in the weld lab and practice, it becomes more easier. So far, it's, it's an amazing experience for sure. We have the best uh, instructors and they taught us a lot. Definitely, uh, we deserve a lot of credit for that. We are more than just a college. Some say that we thrive off of challenges and failures, but we still have more room than ever to improve. In order to become the greatest of all time, we stick together and execute what needs to be done. We are more than just a college. We are a university. It begins from within.
My name is uh, Thomas Nimrod. I am from Kiantz, Arizona. My major is in the IT field. Well, I chose to study in the IT field because I felt it was a good field to grow in and uh, it's very uh, challenging and I like to learn about technology. And also one other thing was uh, the I like to know the security parts to help my people when it comes to um, like Facebook or any technology stuff, especially with the elderly and the younger generation. I would like to show them that technology is a good field to go into and, um, and prosper. I chose the tribal school, the well, NCU for a record. I chose it because my older brother came to school here and uh, he told me about this place, in which uh, I want to follow in his footsteps. Not only that, I wanted to support my Navajo tribe and uh, get a better education than when they return to my tribe and uh, help them. Well, the school really did support me, especially with the instructors. Uh, the instructors were really, they reached out to me and um, I was able to work out a schedule with them through Zoom and through Google Meets. And uh, with, uh, before we had Moodle, now we have Blackboard. Those are very, very uh, useful. And not only that, the student, uh, the school had me, gave me some money when I needed it, especially in a hard time with uh, food and uh, not being able to go any places. Okay, uh, this is really good because I've been trying to get my nieces and nephews to come to school here because NCU is full of opportunities if you really get involved. And uh, for the past year now, I'm a junior, I've been getting involved a lot more and a lot more opportunities have uh, come available to me, especially right now in this interview. And uh, this is like another opportunity for me.
Napa Technical University Culinary Arts Program, Baking, and Hotel Restaurant Administration Program. We provide our students with as many marketable skills as possible. We will cover everything from food safety and sanitation all the way up to classes such as Hospitality Law for the Bachelor's Program. Hi, my name is Deanna James. I am originally from South Lake, New Mexico, but reside in Crown Point, New Mexico, and I am a student here in the Business Administration Program. I am in the Business Bachelor's of Arts in the Business Administration Program. The reason why I chose Business Administration is because my grandfather taught me to hustle. My grandfather taught me to be more organized, to have time management, and he's the main reason why I chose the program. I chose a TCU because based on it's affordable, it's close to home, and it's where you can get the same quality education as a regular university. NTU has done a lot for me. NTU has helped me with gas, has helped me with income, additional income during the pandemic. The main thing is giving me the opportunity to tutor students during the pandemic from face-to-face -to, -face, um, to counter into Zoom. So to into you has done a lot.
design your, your arrow to go beyond 50. So I want you to look at the arrow all the way down. When I make my, my students shoot, we try to look at the arrow. We study the arrow.
We really do encourage you students to come by the welding shop to check out all the equipment we have. Uh, test your ability to welding. You spend more time in the weld lab. In practice, it becomes more easier. So far, it's, it's an amazing experience for sure. We have the best uh, instructors and they've taught us a lot. Definitely, uh, they deserve a lot of credit for that. We are more than just a college. Some say that we thrive off of challenges and failures, but we still have more room than ever to improve. In order to become the greatest of all time, we stick together and execute what needs to be done. We are more than just a college. We are a university. It begins from within.
Navajo Nation. We also want to welcome you to the 2023 Navajo Nation Inauguration Ceremony. Let us all be seated accordingly. Our floor here, you must have a wristband to be on the floor. Just some general rules that we need to abide by for the safety of the public. And we're running a, a little bit on Indian time because of traffic issues. Are you kidding? Uh, that need to let me know. Hala nagrede at the nebel siya ay jeto at the naya ay kaka. So we ask at this time to try to be seated, ladies and gentlemen, our distinguished guests, our visitors, our audience. And just some reminders to please silence your phones. Please silence your phones. Bish behenne, bethen jo pase, bedetiskis. So please silence your cell phones at this time. We want to say thank you to the Windorock Unified School District for allowing us to use the Behostel Fighting Scouts Event Center. Come on, let's give them a round of applause that we can assemble together in this beautiful facility. We also want to mention our sponsors. Without them, we would not have this event be possible. Our sponsors are seated in the second row of chairs in the back. I'm going to quickly go through our sponsor list. Navajo Nation Oil and Gas Company. Round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. CKP Insurance. Alration, CEO of Innovative Electric, Navajo owned and operated. Deneh Development Corporation, the Navajo Nation Executive Branch, the Navajo Nation Gaming Enterprise, Public Service Company of New Mexico, NTUA Wireless, Andy Frayne Service, Red Streak LLC, NeteraEnergy.com, Navajo Transitional Energy Company, Navajo Power, Navajo Technical University, Native Resource Development Incorporated, Penny Emerson, Building Nations LLC, Red Mesa Trading, Indigenous Design Studio and Architecture, Tamara Begay, Danette College, 24th Navajo Nation Council, Tuba City Regional Healthcare Incorporated. Barry Butler, Butler's Office Supply and in Equipment and Supply Incorporated out of Gallup, New Mexico, Elk Petroleum, George Rivera Tribal Solutions, HN4 Solutions LLC, Mr. Spencer Willie, 
Earl's Restaurant in Gallup, New Mexico, Gallup Propane Project Development Department, the Division of Economic Development, the Navajo Arts and Crafts Enterprise for our beautiful stage donation decorations. If we would please be seated. Ado Nelchanal Kidibi Yajitan Hinasigido Ahia. And we also want to say thank you to Navajo Technical University for streaming our event here today. And to our local radio stations. Out of St. Michael's, Arizona, KTNN, 660 AM, 101.5 FM, KKNS out of Albuquerque, KGAK, 1330 AM out of Gallup, New Mexico, KNDN, 960 AM out of Farmington, New Mexico, KHAC, 880 AM out of Cebenito, New Mexico. announcement <laughs> Nle tatal chi exit tapaka ischa. In case of an emergency, a ad those are the exits. Ad shinch atahuist it dorlet. Ado niki cell phone the halonigi. If you would be kind to turn those off. And um, I would like to um, say yat eshik edo shidane. I ye see pashet hojongo koto MC. A kaishie di ki pashat kojo. Ado hehe anotsko nzade da so keiki. Ado da isinots aiki. Deeds eda pahojongo at ego nikinat ani nahat lehiki pa hetanitsen. Kuto nasko anilsko a kadija. She e peri oje in a shea. Ado n sliniki e kina ani n sligo na kaidene pashis chin. Kintli chini dash a che nanest eze dash a nalle. But inash inike a earl Chris will ye? Ado not ani nesde, ade in higan. Ado shiaj lidel. I'm very honored to do this MC job with you. You are an expert at this, and I'm very humble to, to do this job with you. Thank you, Lidell. She is the mistress of ceremony, Mrs. Betty O.J. Tohto. While we are still getting seated, for our distinguished guests that are here on the floor, some have reserved seats. We also have former presidents, former chairman of the great Navajo Nation. What a privilege and an honor it is to be here today. I say in Also, while we are ready to begin our program, I would like to say thank you to all of you who believed in Dr. Nygren, who supported him every step of the way. 
to all the BOO teams who work tirelessly from all four directions of our nation. Give yourself a big hand because you know who you are. In our program, there is a special recognition of the campaign chairs and the 2023 Navajo Nation Inaugural Committee. At this time, why don't you stand and please be recognized. The Nigrin Montoya Campaign Chairs and the Navajo Nation Inaugural Committee. Another quick announcement. As Twido son in Hiahulonigi, for our elders that are here, if, if they need to go to the restroom, we have some restrooms back here. On this side, to my right, and also to my left. Just an announcement for our elders. As Twido son in Hiahulonigi, 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 Nihimasan Nihiche Nihinale. Come on, Navajo Nation, we could do better than that. Hasane, Stuisani Nihimasan Nihiche, Kono Sanigi, Hia. We're going to get started shortly. I know we're on a little delay because of traffic issues. Kind of reminds you of a uh, fair time, right? So if... Our 25th Navajo Nation Council, ladies and gentlemen, Navajo Board of Education. Edo The Navajo Board of Election Supervisors. The Nebuke Apokaja. Adait Nis. Bedain Nisha. Tenehshi. Do. Anidiginat. Ani. Yanada. Dil Nito. Trodoneshi. Kayenta Township. Basho. Nat. Ani. Yada. Dil Nito. Lis. Nahaschidi Commission. Nahaschidaja. Tratnazele. Benat. Ani. Do. Plan 6 Navajo School Board, the third teacher, Yadat in Nipanan, the Shade Leto Lech. Also, this morning, I've seen a lot of school buses coming in, and we want to welcome our children from all across the Navajo Nation who are here. Welcome to Window Rock, all our children. Thank you. They are our future leaders, and we are so thankful, and we welcome you to, to this occasion today. We know it's going to be something that you will remember for the rest of your life. We know that it's going to be a wonderful impact to you that you will be motivated because this is the day that we are we are going to have our first youngest president ever of the Navajo Nation. We also want to take this opportunity to uh, again thank the Window Rock School District for hosting us. We also want to thank um, Winslow High School Orchestra, who was playing for us earlier. Thank you, Winslow. 
And we also want to thank Kirtland Central High School Band for also being here. And each and every one of you who have come from far places, we welcome you. Today you look so beautiful. It's a wonderful, beautiful day. Thank you. We also want to recognize our Navajo Division of Public Safety, Navajo Police Department, Navajo EMS, Navajo Nation Fire Department, and also to the Sheriff's Departments from the Apache County Sheriff's Office, so we want to say thank you also to the Navajo Nation Inauguration Committee. It takes a lot of collaboration to do an event this big. Another reminder, just please silence your phones. So while we wait, if the band could play us a number or two, while we're still being seated, Let's give a round of applause to our bands here, Winslow High School Orchestra, and also the Kirtland Central High School Band.
Ladies and gentlemen, on the floor and also in the stands, if we could be seated at this time. Kaye, nakadano pihia, shunat ani, no senigido, aden hitni nasigi, kaye, akodadiz. We're going to get the inauguration ceremony started in just a few seconds. We can mingle after the inauguration. We're going to get started here in just a few seconds, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, we're go we are getting ready for the procession. So, ladies and gentlemen, we ple would you please take your seat? At this time, and we are going to begin the procession. And we ask that at this time, everybody please stand. Please stand for the procession. First of all, coming in would be the Navajo Nation Board of Election Supervisors. Navajo Nation. Board of Election Supervisors. Following that procession will be the Navajo Board of Education. Following that will be the Navajo Plan 6 School Boards, Adobiqueto Cayenta Township, the Nashchiti Commission, and the Navajo Nation Council. Kodoshi Nihinan Daidan Zinigi Nihisya Hikato Les Azanje Kodoba Sohigi Adai Nis Badai Nisha Tsunehashi Ain Hisya Hado Kahaya Baikida Kad the Navajo Board of Election Supervisors. Na kone Navajo Board of Education haya ya da dosni ya oltabits in the hsg edo dj ya da dilni Navajo Plan 6 school boards haya ba ya da khat koni khata holo Kayenta Township todonashi benat a haya ya da dosni ya ba ya da khat Nahashchidaje Nahashchidi Commission edo ko ya da bitilni the 25th Navajo Nation Council. Stephen 
R. Arviso. Nihinant ay. Na kune. Lamardo Aserit. Yate Stephen Arviso Ainge, yet since a cardinal in Schlobit and the Bushes Chain, Kachini does a chate, could it eat the eight as a nala, Ado Yambit Hotdo, Church Rock, Pinedale, Mariana Lake, Smith Lake, and Thuru, a Banash, no cat and Hano, yet are no so. Yate J. Lamardo as a red ain't, yeah. Nana Stazer Tachin in Slaw Nakaidene, Filipino Desne, E Bashes Chin, Clasche, E Dashiche Ado E Tessa Un, my age ho Nat at Zeal, say it ho, do can tail, E Banashado, a shahla Norman Embege. Followed by Helena Nesby Gay. Yate, said Nero, she cared on a singing quit and eat lingi. She, yeah, that's a noble laconic as she again, Norman M. Begay, Etaia, Sujida Yila, B. I. A. I do ya take it a sneerly. Now, Kate Nan's law, look about his chin. I do she ate as a chee. I do two bazin as eight as a nulla. Out of it, ne. I can't leave a lesson on it. I don't even a shaggy. Get us a nashada is nilgaya. This so. Elmo chapter. I don't get it. Rachin. Rima chapter. I don't know. I get a torchy lecture. Yeah. Torchy le chapter. I don't be getting get Washington. I'm being kids. I'm getting a Elmo band of Navajo. But in being kids. I'm a Washington. I don't. Rayma Jura, what the Rayma Ben of Navajo go. I don't get what you let you can see the Ben of Navajo. It all gets here now. Thank you. Yate, she gave us the Neche, Helena Nesby Gay, and she had to eat in Slank, is a son of Bush's chain, now Kaida Neta, she chain, now she is a top on Hata Shinale, Sheik, a Bitodo, Tanalia, Do Besha Gate, the Chi. Up next, Honorable Eugenia Charles Newton, followed by Shana Ann Claw. Yat A, Anosqua. Yat A, welcome, welcome. She Eugenia Charles Newton and she I don't know that and she didn't get a bit at me. I she was just chain. I she is a chain. To a person nala. To a day I don't know. She a banana. Banana nish. So welcome everyone. It's good to see everybody here and enjoy today. Be blessed. Have on that. Thank you. After Miss Shana and Claw, we have Honorable Amber Kenazbot Crotty. Yat e, shik e, do shidine, she has twi, shizani, a check and do silke, that ehigi, do yat and the schneedole, she e, shana and claw, the shidine, ado donne and schlinigi e ya, who wants an in a schneedo, twitch eat ne, but she's chin, kachin e, does she chedo, kia ani, does she nulla, quit a mado a son schle, ado a yisi dent, na shahigi e ya, nuzlin, kajit ha, will ye dent. A conde a ya, coach in lee, but her doggy a banash nestole, though no hassazido. A joshi yat a big a gi a yat and a schnidole, though a hair and scargo. A go on it. Thank you. After Honorable Amber Kenazba Crotty, we have Crystalline Curly. Yat e shadene shik es kia ani nishle do dilagana bashes chin des chini desha che do dilagana desha nale she amber kainas ba karate karate like karate chop 
I represent Sheep Springs, Two Gray Hills, Tolina, Tonosti, Red Valley, Cove, Gadiahi, and Biklabato. But I represent all you beautiful people here that are living in our four sacred mountains, working and going to school outside, and our military families that are helping and serving our country internationally. We want to thank all of our families of our missing and murdered Diné relatives who are still here searching for their relatives. Pray for them as we pray for one another. Ahiahat. Thank you. Crystalline Curley. Yate Shike, Shay Crystalline Curley, Nishye, Senja Kinnan Nishle, Twelt Head Lini, Bushes Chin, Kia Ani Dasha Che, Zithat the Kia Ani E Dashanelle, Hot A Mato A Sun in Nishle, Twelt Halete E Nasha, Fish Point, Arizona. Ado a schlatko, e kodopa nash nishto le tat nas nit nas nidri, e e a talanato tsalagoides, aha, bistot ijin deskij, je des a nazlene do dag ehelane, ado a jehe ate and hano kregi do a da da hosia, a jehe. Thank you. Herman M. Daniels, followed by Vince R. James. Yat e hepene. Dola eats ada. Nana sha. Good morning. Yat e hepene. Ado kodo tam. Shit e shikodo. Herman Daniels Jr. E ishishi. Ado nana ado ne en shlinge e bet ani. Ado nana kitlachini e dasu je. Toy e tlini e dasu che. Ashkazo e dasu nala. Ahota. Eh, Nikidini, do let it be a big year. I don't know, Quedo, but not as Quedo. I have my wife, Quedo, my beautiful wife, Leda Suzanko, Teresa Daniels. Eh, Quedo. I don't Quedo, I just want to thank you, Quedo, President Quedo Shanale. Thank you. I don't know, Quedo, I don't vice president. Shalan Ash, Lina Ash, Enigi. Thank you for coming. I don't Quedo, Banash, Nishigaya, Nansas An, or Jetro. I'll be serving on the 25th Navajo Nation Council, 21st, 23rd, 24th, and now 25th Council. Thank you. Honorable Vince James. Yat e Shade ya Vince James in Chiedo, Twodich eaten in Chlon, said Najini Bashish Chin. Kia Ani dasha Chedo, Hanawani dasha Nale. Adon da Tatnas Nele, but Hatta Shahiki. E yakin dasha Chi. Look on Tail. It's the Tra. Oye, Jedito. Kitlichi, Ganado, Cornfield, Steamboat, and Jedito. E what are e? Tatnas Nele, but Hatta Shako. A Koyat e. God bless the Navajo Nation, God bless the United States of America. Ms. Brenda Jesus. Yat e a bene, shik e shit na, she e ya, Brenda, Jesus, yan shiedo, tenajinin shlo, twitch e ni, bashish chin, honara ni, dasha chedo, to, hane, dasha nale, ado joho, so ye da e ada ech eshike, ado dishji de e ade, um, she caught the little dosha tot saka, um, ado de nebis in na dish ini dosha, as chinese, hot a e ya, amado, a masane beshik e holjij. Ado o kia shik e shit na ada ang kai so kai gi. Kodo kia our communities bandish nishi e ya 
St. Michael's Community, Oak Springs and Pine Springs Community, all the other communities on the Navajo Nation. God bless you. Thank you. Mr. Casey Ellen Johnson. Yeah, there's a kid, those the name, Shay Casey Johnson, you share. My days, he's the initial, has gone, has all bushes, chin, Hanan, the dish, a chay, Tinajini dish, and Ella, we got ego, the name, the I'm representing Cameron Chapter, Coal Mine, Bird Springs, Talani Lake, and Loop. Just want to thank everybody for being here. God bless you. Thank you, Honorable Ricky Ness. Chapter Donia. Out of my lovely wife, thank you, Audrey. How do I represent six chapters? Set a calm San Juan in Anisa, Dol Kait, East Osaka, Dot East and Deshkish. God bless each and every one of you. Thank you. Dr. Andy Ness. Yat a ade, Shikado, Shid Nash, at Kahasi. A yaha, Kodo, quite any haini ya, auto quite gishi jet. Dr. Andy Ness, a yin shia. Ogin the Slido, Kodich eat any a bushes chin, cut cheat any a dash a chedo, class che a dash another. She a a condo, naho consigo eight, at the yassi tahojene, ardent shikado, a ardent shama, shamasani yand, or shamake a shinesa. Fortified, Sawmill, Crystal, and Red Lake. And I am thrilled to get to work and I'm excited. And y'all, I have to take a selfie with everyone. So I'm gonna turn around. Thank you all. Thank you all of our students who are here. I am all about education. And I am looking forward to working with all of you. Ahyat. Thank you. Mr. Nathan Nota. Yate Kahasilo. Say Nathan Nota in Shiatoach at Oe Nasha. Cougar Country. Diego Nash Dutsa. Banash Nishigisada is Agi E. Tohach at O Nashida. Bastla. My Kate Lizard Dot Nakhide. I'm glad to be here and we hope to do a good job. I want to thank my family in Roji. Thank you. Miss Shandine Parrish. Yeah, it's a shik a ama a je a masana a che anella dano sliniki. Yeah, it's a she a kia ani adole and a shlingo do bashish chin. Thank you. Ms. Jermaine Simonson. Yat <laughs> A a ya aro a bag at Bahotan, a ya a banashado de Dokia Hat and Hanoya. Thank you, Mr. Danny Simpson. Yatishke, my leaders, I say, Kaki Tita, a yat a binna, though Danny Simpson, she, a twenty inch, she was his chair, no such as no, doesn't take. Though I say, Kaki Tita, and I'll clean it in Ashka, New Mexico, there, though Divan Ashkai chapters, 
A. Herfano, Nayeezy, Vicente, White Rock, Lake Valley, Crown Point, Nandishkis, Tseya, Ah, Sandy Rock, Laos. Do I say here? I know, kiddo. Again, God bless everyone. Thank you. Mr. Carl Russell Slater. Yat Eshik Edo, Shadane, Adona and Nishanagi, Eki Ani, Shay Santone, Bashashin, Tinajani Dashate, Do, Santone, Dashanella. This door closed as a day not sha. Shay Carl Russell Slater, Dashajane. My name is Carl Russell Slater. I'm Kia Ani, born for the Jewish people, and I'm humbled and honored to represent Round Rock, Rock Points, at Chizha, Rough Rock, Lookout Chukai, and Sayli Wheatfields on the Navajo Nation Council. Ahyeha, and thank you for your presence today. Mr. George Told. Yat e shik e shidene stui sani tsuki salatso kwe yai shahos agi. George Told in shke aro bilkin shnani do bilkin shkato shik e lenegi. I've been married to my wife for 48 years, so my wife is in the crowd, so. But Anin Slon, Kia Ani Bashachina could nay hide the Shachi, but our Ayahe Biswas Anshit Ashit Ilya. Ado, the chapter I will represent a Baka, Casimir Lake, Little Water, White Horse Lake, Pine uh, Bentara, Counselor, and Own Sino and Torion chapter. So I'll be the next counselor delegate for that. So thank you very much. Honorable Speaker of the Navajo Nation, Otto So. Yeah. Yat e hat e dais ad e shidanashik e. She ya auto so e dashijane. Na kite na toy get leaning shle. Nanesh edge a tapa ha e bashishin. Look at the net, it does it shake. Dot Sena Jinny, it does another. Oh, that it nenshle. Toneness, there's a day, ya, Nasha. Toneness, there's a day, Chishikato. Ah, ah, de, de, na, heta, the national, ah, say, be na, heta, the national, ah, kakote, near Tanin and Anslego holders. A kahela, a de, Kano Yahagi. Thank you. Mr. Curtis Yanito. Yate. But all his own old ladies, and yard all the seat lane. She, yeah, Curtis Yanito, and she, yeah, I don't last chance, le. Yate, she, eh. I don't the Torich in the end, that's a jet, that's a tra, yat is a jet. I don't the Tanes San Ed, that's a che. Yat is a che. Sit see. I don't talk by it, that's another yat, eh, I'm not so enough, that's all leaky. But I young Zonoko end out it, I've been yak when Hadaho, I don't hard as you know. We need change it, oh, Nelson, I'm not so, that's what we're standing here for. Thank you, Miss Sherilyn Yazi. Hello, everybody. Look, all the beautiful people here. Thank you for coming out to celebrate this uh, change. I guess is what we're going to do again, and I really do appreciate it. She when I and I look forward to working with the communities that I will be representing of Tisto, Delcon, Hinden Wells, White Cone, and Greasewood. And I want to do that in a, I want to be a good relative to everybody and do it in an honest and respectful manner. Thank you. Mr. Seth Damon. Thank you very much. Good morning, Yate Bennett, everyone out there. Thank you very much for coming to the transition of power. 
And most importantly, thank you for being a part of the Navajo Nation government. My name is Seth Damon. I'm Bitani. Born for Nanastaja Tachitni, Do Ashitni, Eda Shiche, Sebedne, Eda Shinella. I just want to welcome everybody here to the home of the scouts. Good morning, Mr. President, Mr. Vice President, all our former leaders, all our current leaders, to all the community members out there. Thank you very much for supporting your delegates, your people, and who you elected. Thank you very much for being here this morning. I represent chapters that surround Gallup, New Mexico, and all of pretty much Gallup, New Mexico. I'm a delegate from there. I come from a place south of Gallup, New Mexico, called Bake Id, from Baja Lane, New Mexico. I also represent Chechota, Selechi, Manuelito, uh, Se, uh, Sechija, and Seato. So I just want to say good morning to all my communities out there. Have a good day, and thank you very much again for being here this morning. I look forward to the 25th Council, working with all, every single one of you. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, how about a round of applause for the 25th Navajo Nation Council. Let's remain standing as we call to the platform your new Navajo Nation administration, the Nigran Montoya administration. The Honorable uh, Navajo Nation Vice President-Elect, Dr. Boo Van Nigren. <laughs> Along with his wife, First Lady of the Navajo Nation, Jasmine Blackwater Nigren. Also welcoming to the platform, your first female Navajo Nation Vice President-Elect, Rochelle Montoya. <laughs> Along with her husband, second gentleman of the Navajo Nation, Mr. Olsen Chi. <laughs> Navajo Nation, let's hear it for the 2023 Navajo Nation Inauguration Ceremony. We are streaming live via Navajo Technical University on YouTube, Facebook, and also our radio station KTNN, KGAK, KXAC, KNDN, and KCZY. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen that are in the stadium, if you would please remove your headgear, your headwear as we receive our colors. From the Dene Sani Salasoy Color Guard, round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Carrying the United States flag, Helen Helena B. Anthony, United States Marine Corps veteran out of Gallup, New Mexico. Carrying the Navajo Nation flag, Alcina Baker, United States Navy, United States Army veteran. Also carrying the Arizona state flag, Shana Roanhorse, United States Army veteran out of Windrock, Arizona. Carrying the Utah state flag, Laris Manuelito, United States Army veteran of Tohatchi, New Mexico. Carrying the POW flag, Mary T. Coho, American Red Cross veteran in country Vietnam, veteran from Pine Hill, New Mexico, commanding color guard, will be Major Edna Ashley.
singing the Navajo national anthem, Miss Kylie McCurtain. Followed by the Pledge of Allegiance in the Nebuzad, Jules E. Jones. Make your way to the platform, please. I come from Raymond Nava community, and I go to school at Chechuk Todd Jones Ranch Community School. Ya sho dan do le i hai old kans bi de ba da we. <laughs> now to do the Pledge of Allegiance in the Nebuzad. Adanek Ache, Dahnat Ae, Baha Atzihigi, Miss Ganado Primary Princess Jules E. Jones. Ya it's Ache, a Jules Elizabeth Jones, and she had Tabo Hanishkle, my Deskishni Bashishi, Totoni Deshichi. Round of applause. Thank you so much. Round of applause for Dinesh Sani Salafso Color Guard. Ladies and gentlemen, please be seated. I am your master of ceremony. My name is Lydell Rafael. 
coming all the way from Eastern Navajo Agency out of Torreon, New Mexico. Come on, Torreon, let's hear it. Program Director so to all our visitors, welcome to the great Navajo Diné Nation. Thank you, Lydell. Next on our agenda, while Evangelist Harrison Mann is making his way up here, I would like to take this opportunity to welcome our president, Jonathan Nez, and First Lady, Fafilia. Please give them a warm welcome today. And Vice President, Myron Lizer, and Second Lady, Dottie. Welcome, welcome, and thank you so much for serving our people. Thank you once again for, for standing up. And, we, and you took a little break. Now we're going to ask you to stand up one more time for the invocation. The invocation will be presented by Evangelist Harrison Mann Ministries from Kaibato, Arizona. Good morning. On behalf of the Navajo Nation, we welcome you. Uh, Harrison, man, when he is here, I don't know Let's all bow our heads. And pray this morning, and let's give this uh, occasion, this service, into the almighty hands of God. Amen. Father, we just come before you. Father, we, I ask you today that we ask you to surround this building from the ceiling to the floor and the four walls of this building today. Father God, let your angels camp around us, Father God, uh, that there will be no harm, but your spirit will be manifest within this place. I pray that, God, that you continue and strengthen uh, this nation, this Navajo great nation. Father God, that we will prosper, that we will succeed uh, with this new, my God, administration that we are going to go into, Father God. Uh, the leadership, the council of delegates, and, and every leader of every, uh, every community that is here today, Father, that we ask you for your blessing blessings over us, Lord, and continue to strengthen us. We ask you for your wisdom, for your knowledge, and your understanding that comes from your word, Lord God, and that we pray that, God, that you continue to heal our nation as well in this four corners, Father God. Father, and Lord God, that we pray that we're going to overcome this COVID-19, Father God, and not zito letter then that she leave father the almighty father god uh, that you reach down from heaven uh, that you ask for your grace and mercy over this building uh, and over this congregation today that our presence uh, and that are watching online and on tv as well uh, across this nation father god uh, and continue to bless us uh, and to continue for oh my god uh, as we turn on in this life father god uh, watch over us uh, and be the center of this now great navajo nation in the mighty hands of you in Jesus name we pray and all God's children said you may be seated and we recognize and today we honor all faiths come on Navajo Nation 
Thank you. We're going to go ahead and introduce and recognize our VIPs. We're going to start off with my brother, the Honorable President of the Navajo Nation and First Lady, Jonathan Nez and Fifilia Nez. Also, Vice President of the Navajo Nation, Mr. Myron Lizer and Second Lady Dottie Lizer. Thank you. We also have a former Navajo Nation President, two-term Navajo Nation President, Shuche, Dr. Joe Shirley Jr., along with his wife, Shanelle Vicky Shirley. Also, former Navajo Nation President, Shuche, Mr. Ben Shelley. We also have Chairman and President and Distinguished Navajo Co-Talker, Mr. Peter McDonald and his lovely wife, Wanda McDonald. We also have Miss Navajo Nation, Miss Valentina Klitzo, all the way from Zitlijin, Arizona. And if all our delegates and officials that are seated here in the VIP section would stand to your feet as we recognize you, state, local, Navajo Nation, tribal officials, if you would stand to your feet. From the state of New Mexico, the state of Arizona, and the state of Utah, and also representatives from the state of New Mexico, thank you for being here. Also representing former Navajo Nation President Russell Begay as his sister here in the front, if you would stand. Yeah. I'm going to turn it back over to our other MC to go down to the with the program. Yeah. The welcome address. The Honorable Otto So. The 24th Navajo Nation Council Speaker and the Navajo Nation Council Delegate, please welcome the Honorable Otto So, our current Speaker of the Navajo Nation Council. Yeah. And then, uh, Kano Yahagi. It is an honor to welcome you, the Navajo people. The Navajo people. The Navajo the bench, ha. Look or sleep. Just now, Dilly. Just all in. Then I get in. 
Sit in there. Yeah, God, I think so. You need your whole nation, Lenny, Kadia, eat Hadoka. Need eat Sade, then the Hide Yade, could it is shed at the eat sea? This shed at the Nita. Could all Nihinant Adani Tlego. Benny Hikeda with she. But Sana O Kathy could a tar hot sang behold us. The Nan Lenny at no yani. Hat is in the hit is ani leke hot end. Nihi caught the shed. Nihi chest lag. And now hot egg a yisip in Yakoto. Not ani ni cleany kodo eh. Nihinel ago eh. The Nan of Senegay. They learn if he laid or let that of Nego at a big at the door sneak. A distrig, eh, what ego, eh, con, Nahano Yato, or Nin Lenny Cotto. Nay, Nigel Nasset. Not Anni Yat Ehi, not Anni Yashoni, Banana Ya. Nej nas your left or lit. Then I lean its edo cut or lit. Sedo cat edo lit, eh, a ye sip in ya, but shall not end it. Did you do chili? Did you say you hindo tati? A yego, but shall not end now, Babinach, has your nas ye tart? Not on any clean you could all. Nicked an end, he had. Bessil Dago cut off, but not yet evening. Nicky that is it all at any hitch, a calet ego yard eho, Naha, not a hand lenny, Naha nasty the door. A not in lenny a horn asla, be ye ka a witch, though chohot echo. Nte, but lahni ado it is, nisto a had it ego da, yard eho. I can't let you not a not a not a lenny, not it at all. Then I need to open in not a neck at an hitch a yasht. Nihizar, holla. Nihin, holla. Nihit sodas in the holla. Nihal is lenny, holla. Then he did not let all the Haishit at the Nani Clan. Now by Honey Clan, Bella Slain it. Nikhil thought out what ego. Bani see Kesa in Nan Lenny Nitsen. Double Lata did chitter. Double Otani Center. Ask it, ask it, kitty can eat sin. Hala eh. I don't know any clinic because of Toddich ain't it. Kia ani. Hush this knee. I don't need yard, I don't know any clinic, quite be any ego conquer it. I said that he did. I said the need legal, eh, Paul. Tina has it, can't I dish it in that? Nay, Nigel Nasset, cut off. Now, I gave her your nasty guard only. Did a district. This is the first ever inauguration that you will see where you have the Chief Justice and the Associate Justice. And you see, I have the council delegate elect the 25th Navajo Nation Council. And you have President elect Boone Nigren. And Vice President elect Rochelle Montoya, and the former Speaker of the Navajo Nation Council, Lorenzo Bates. This is the first time ever, not on in it, Lenny Kodope, I guess, on Nahati, Nahat, and Nichet Yat Echo, 
as kis edo hajo as kis na anish to symbolize unity to symbolize working with one another because we have a nation to run we have a nation to continue to nourish qala en khia det nano khiniki na kha o ahdo ni khia na tani e atani khosa na tani leni comes to you without going for it. But it's it. She doesn't need that she Out of a cut and chin. Out of a cut out of that little chin. Out of a way it's it. The net was sung. Go eh out there. The net out there. Yeah, there's an ant. Yeah, there's a chin. What a door needle. Nikin ant and lean. Nikon has tanigi. Each and every one of them have, has demonstrated that. Their kinship. To the local people, your constituency. Ah, ah, oh, bad. He not issued the na. Do she k? Do hard the na sa ida. Do hard ha she ikhada. A che masan nini she ya hot a. Ebenan kin sada yin ne ik e it ego. Be kot ego kot e. Na hat an nini kot o na stay nit a she the na. As the speaker of the Navajo Nation Council, I welcome each and every one of you to the sports center, the event center. You at ego, what ego? What the lay, what ego pay, what's it? But what's wrong with you at a lay that the never care of a car get the highs out of night. Bekaya Baka, Nahat Atzi, that I had ya. Beg a bar hot thunder, hot ya conness, there's a ten day with Yego. Nicky the Nabazad Lenny Art, what up at Ehasen? Oh, we have a building that's called Beh Hotzil Event Center. Welcome you here, and I really appreciate every and each and every one of you, former leadership of the Navajo Nation. Again, sent off President Ness. It's nice. Brother, at a ma. I do at it. Ash, nalle. Che. Che. Na ash. Chairman. Yat a do in an a con in the hostago. In the hostago, home to need luck. Yat a hot air la. Not unleaning nas transfer of power is in the midst in the eyes of the former leadership of the Navajo Nation, former leaders, great leaders of this nation. With that, I leave that with you guys. I can have honorable Otto So. And next, we're going to speed up our program because we want to have the oath of office being taken at 12 noon. So next on our agenda, we have the Honorable Lorenzo Bates, former speaker of the Navajo Nation Council. And all of you from Northern Navajo Agency, let's hear it. Let me make, let me make one announcement. Um, after the oath of office and after the um, President uh, Nigren gives his speech, the Navajo Nation Council, we have to exit this uh, building because we have work to do, but it is by law. It's no form of disrespect or anything, but we have to continue to obey and make sure that things happen based off of what the law is. President, Mr. Vice President, President Shirley, and President Shelley, I haven't seen you in for so long. 
don't we all get older or just you? Chairman Peter McDonald, President elect, my, <coughs> not your vice president, 20 foot Navajo Nation Council and the people of the Navajo Nation. <coughs> my name is Lorenzo Bates. Chenjikin, no, 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 Lea Tolkayana Nasha. I've had thank you. I've had the honor of being a public official for 16 years. I think President Shirley was way longer than me. And I know President Shelley was way longer than me too. But nonetheless, you know, 16 years is 16 years. But as during that time, I was chairman of the Ethics and Rules Committee and then became Budget and Finance Committee uh, chairman. And President Nez was my vice chair at the time. <clears throat> and then I became speaker for two consecutive terms. Uh, today, today I want to welcome the new leadership. All that is here. To, to a great day. And because it is a great day, this is a day for our Dinesh citizens, a day of democracy, a day of renewal and resolution. Today, we celebrate the will of the people, and with it, every election, democracy is paramount. And as speaker so indicated that is why leadership is here today because of the people that voted you all into office as leaders of this great nation you will have the awesome awesome responsibility of defending our sovereignty ensuring that the federal government is is adhering to their Federal trust responsibility as outlined, as outlined in the Treaty of 1868. Most importantly, during this process, you will be ensuring that our Diné people are protected and given the resources to strive from our dear children to our elders. The Navajo Nation government was organized in the 1920s. Before an organized government, we had leaders such as Chief Manolito, who believed in advancing the education. Councilwoman Annie Dodge Unica, a public health activist who worked tirelessly to improve the health and welfare of our Navajo people. Our former leaders believed in ceremonies in our homes, in our hearts, and led with purpose. As we all experienced and we saw the pandemic, our nation was challenged. In many ways, as the virus plagued our nation, thousands of lives were lost, but no one was forgotten. We witnessed the steadfast leadership of the Navajo leaders to address a public health crisis that has fundamentally changed our lives from the time that this pandemic came on and in our communities. For that, we thank you for taking on that role. Our nation has met these challenges with resilience. Despite the recent hardships, our people remain strong. These burdens have met, been met with strength 
from our warriors, from healthcare workers, educators, public safety workers. We owe a huge, huge debt of gratitude to all these modern day warriors for their leadership in keeping our communities safe. The incoming leadership and administration will be met with the current challenges and with new challenges as you move forward. As outlined in the Navajo Nation Code, the powers of the executive branch are clearly defined. The Navajo Nation Council, the governing body of the Navajo Nation, has the authority to enact policies and laws to address the immediate and future needs of our people. while maintaining their interests. The road ahead is promising. And for the first time in the history of the nation's history, the federal government has invested billions of dollars in the Indian country. It will be up to this incoming leadership, as with past leadership, to ensure that these funds are invested for the good of our people, the people in this room. And during that time, you will be working with federal, state, local, and tribal leaders to bring real and lasting changes to the Navajo Nation as you go forward. Four years will be quick, believe me. We need a comprehensive strategy that will combat the health disparities, creating jobs, closing the opportunity gap, and leaving something for the future. Above all, the future of Navajo rests in the education of our children. These efforts are not can become moot if we cannot provide a safe place for the children, our future, to survive. We encourage you to take these challenges seriously as you go forward. During the campaign trail, there were pledges and commitments heard. Remember, your words are sacred and the people will we'll remind you daily of these obligations. I close today to remind our leaders of your responsibilities. I pray for each of you and your families as you take this new journey. Few had the honor of serving in. Continue to defend our sovereignty our way of life, and think not of power, but of possibilities as you go forward. I can't. I also forgot to recognize mother of the Navajo Nation, the Honorable Dr. Luva Tahozi. Right in the front there. Yeah. At this time, we're going to call up Chisha Hasba Montoya to come and share the inaugural poem as the Kirtland Central High School Band gets ready to share a special musical number. Right after, we'll have our Vice President remarks. How about a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen?
or Tseresh Gijni Dasha Che, Tatneza Hnida Shanele, um, Le Sedil Doe, Dan Asha, Badilda, Senile, um, Deshagan. Um, before anything else, I'm a mother, a daughter, a granddaughter. Um, Shama E, Dolly Manson, will ya, Shija E, Alex Montoya, will ya. Um, I am a student, I'm working on my Master's of Fine Arts degree at American Indian Arts in Santa Fe, New Mexico. I'm honored and humbled to be standing here before my beautiful people. I'm beyond honored to share this time and space with you and bear witness to Shibija Shimayaja Rochelle Montoya take her place in office as the first Dine Asan to hold one of the top two Navajo political positions in history. Congratulations to Dr. Boo Nigren and the upcoming administration. I'm here today to share a poem I wrote. It's called, um, Beauty Will Return. Hashi hot eh? Do hujwanda has lean, do ya at eta. Neha be hot old zeal. Hujwana hot old lel. Ya at eh na hot old lel. She has twee, she zani, she da a yon, she al chine, she tsuike. The stars above move across the night sky and our prayers rise with ceremonial fire that by morning dwindles. The daybreak, the powerful sun, warms our face, our sacred body with blessings, with hope. By dawn, we recognize the na yet. Clenched between our fingers, we sprinkle corn pollen to the east and name our monsters. Colonialism, assimilation, patriarchy. We sang them away all night. We prayed them away all night. Hojon na hadot leh. Yaat eh na hadot leh. The long walk is a monster that still lingers in the darkest of our memories, clawing at our thoughts devouring our recollections. We are the descendants of a people who endured the hunger pains due to livestock reduction and scorched earth policy. We are the descendants of a people whose young minds were molded and tainted by the Biligana's doctrine of discovery. We are descendants of a people who, hel who were held in the claws of the beast of white supremacy. The Christian notion of kill the Indian, save the man. We are the descendants of a people who endured having our sacred language ripped from their tongues, the sacred soil ripped from beneath their feet with governmental policies. Uranium, to feel the Bilagana war, trading humanity for patriotism, feeling the Bilagana's hunger for power, trading sacred yellow corn pollen for po yellow poison, relocation to feel the bottomless belly of Bilagana greed. Missing and murdered Diné to feel the violence that is needed to sustain this unjust need to control, to conquer. As descendants, we bear the scars on our hearts and on our minds. But, we were raised by women who gave birth to courageous slayers of monsters. 
We were raised by women who fought to restore balances, offering us humility, wisdom, and love in sacred bundles of vision and prayer. We must come together and partake in this ceremony of healing. We must come together in this sacred act of dismantling the patriarchy and colonization that has yet to loosen its grip on our future. We must restore the sacredness of women and child, holding them within our palms, their being like the most precious of stones, the most potent of seeds. Let us hold the old ones tight and listen to their voices of endurance. Let us come together as a nation and rise with the sacred smoke that dances to the heavens. Let us uplift one another so that our children can enjoy beautiful harvest forever into the future. <clears throat> May we cultivate the seeds planted ever so carefully and intentionally by our ancestors. May we welcome change in the spirit of Astana Dlehe, changing woman. May we learn the lessons that are plenty in our creation stories. May we help each other climb the ladder into the realm of Hojon, where our children can breathe fresh air and drink uncontaminated water. As the sacred embers go out, as the sacred Hogan has been swept and blessed, we will restore Diné's sovereignty. We will defeat the Naye that still lingers. We will once again hear the chattering of Nehizad by our children like it was never gone, like medicine for our aching hearts. We will move forward in strength and the glittering world will know that we are without demise. Hojona hasli, hojona hasli, hojona hasli, hojona hasli, ahyaha. Ahyaha, thank you. Chisha Hasba Montoya. As we turn the program over to the Kirtland Central High School Band. All the way from Kirtland, New Mexico. Dagas Gaide, Nahachuna, Sendo, Disney, and Danedo Les. As we get Nat Aninez to the platform to be ready.
Kaya Baikanada Kadia. A round of applause for Kirtland Central High School Band. If I heard that song correctly, that was this thing called love. Yeah. <laughs> all right. If we could all stand this morning as we receive our vice presidential remarks from the Honorable Rochelle Montoya. Hiya, <laughs> Dedeetsi. Round of applause, ladies and gentlemen, your first female Navajo Nation Vice President, all the way from Torreon, the Eastern Navajo Agency, Maitsota Seze, New Mexico. Thank you so much, everyone, for being here with us. I will do my best to say this in English and in Navajo for our visiting guests. And I hope next time we're here that everybody in here understands Navajo. <laughs> Our ancestors. They sat upon Sandia Mountain as they were to usher to Huilde. Ashored <laughs> It's sad. The stories that were passed down by our ancestors that were led to Bosque Redondo, but their prayers, their positive thoughts, their way of being is why we are here today. We are here today, standing on the shoulders of our ancestors, Gentlemen, give me a few moments to take this moment in with my matriarchs, the women of the Navajo Nation, the grandmothers, the grandchildren, the mothers, the aunts. Kwaagi, nahisi tra, nlebne tota hoshi kego. They fulfill their destinies. Across the, Navo, the world, our Navajo people, how are we going to help them? Who are we to help them? Who are we to help them? 
If we cannot come to a conclusion, let us come to a solution that we all can agree upon. Council delegate, chapter officials, land board, our representatives, our legislatures of the state of New Mexico, Arizona, Utah, Colorado. We need to come together. We need to be together for the betterment of our Navajo people. We have seven more generations to come behind us. Me, as myself, should say, all these generations that are coming behind us, that is who we have to think about. They are watching us. Everything that we do, they are watching us. How many times have we heard our Navajo language is going? Not according to this young lady. No, it is not. Speak the Navajo language as much as you possibly can, no matter what anybody tells you. I lived through a time at Natnil Jinja Old Torion Day School that all of a sudden we were going 100, per, 100 miles per hour speaking the Navajo language and they told us to stop. And we had to. And then four years later we were told, your language is dying, start speaking it again. It's still within us. Ego 
our ancestors made that possible for us. Navajo Nation Office of the President and Vice President, 25th Navajo Nation Council, Judicial Branch of the Navajo Nation. For the next four years, I will give you my very best. Rochelle Montoya, Ayin Shia, Hush Ishnin Shlot, Hatni Sahni, Bashish Chin, Kinti Chitni Dasha Che, Tachitni Dasha Nale, Nat Nail Jean, Dat Nashna from the state of New Mexico. I am proud and honored and humbled to be your elected Navajo Nation Vice President. Ayaha. Thank you, Honorable Rochelle Montoya. Ado, as MC, I made a decision that we're going to move on to the oaths of office because we want to take our oath of office close to high noon. So, not as singers, I apologize. You're going to be moved up just a little bit. At this time, we are going to have the oath of office conducted by the Honorable Associate Justice Eleanor Shirley, and this will be the order of the Oath of Office. First will be the Navajo Board of Education. You will stand, you'll take the oath. Second group will be the Navajo Board of Election Supervisors. Third will be the Plan 6 Navajo School Boards. And last, fourth group will be Kayenta Township and Nashchiri Commission. Thank you, Honorable Associate Justice Eleanor Shirley. Yad a bene, this jacon, a key caddy, Kodoni, Jetsa, a large and lineage, a dahodisi. Eleanor Shirley, a young in Shia, Don da Kutcher, Adahunt, Aja a day, Adahunt in the Aja a Tashananish in Sanok, the Quishin Shanah Hakat, a Yusina Shahade, ya, Naslande go a ya, Nasha, Do in da Hachitni Enchle, Do Top, ah, my Deshkish ne Ebashish chain, Topa Edasha Che, Don da Toddichitni Edashanelle. A cockot, a dahela barato, a ye see, um, Cheshake, Tata Eben Nacha Eya, Cotto, a dehotzelzenle, um, the Quishi Nache, um, Beshman Sane, Lodo, and the Tartnaz, the Letan Law, Aro, and the, uh, Old Tabernant, I done Lona Hashish, Sheche, George Hubbard. Eta Pajano, a cut a ya, a barado a ya, Cheshake, a coco, a look a hunt lego a ya, a yisina ra, a hot a e, Shamasana a ya, Naslenda gonara, a hot a e, Ado, Benacha a ya, Konzade a ya, Shananish, a nashed it on the Konzade a ya, a coto, a masana don the a month long a year, cut a shenanish insen. Dick a kaya yat the needy bin ye a cottish jet la needle. Yat the nee had no she a ya, not any it law a hashin so. Be a dare hot zolzano, a hot abbe, a dare has the ze. A coco, a benacha a ya, didak a kaya, not any the quill art, a she a ya, cut a yat a deal needy, 
Navajo Board of Elections Supervisor Dan Lini di Eti Yati Nihidi Eya Yikahetahod Lado and the Eya Koto Eben Nacha Eti A Nahapik the Nayatati no Aka Nihina Nish Nailee A Koko Eben Nacha Eya di Elajan Lini di Eya Koto Navajo Board of Elections Supervisor Dan Lini di Shi Ado eya ya te do sinto in the nishnaja eya be ya da da do sne a koko e kaki di e a da do sinto in the eya ka a te ha te zihi di shi e sa kodo ne hi che eya be nan hin shin do le board of election supervisors can you please stand up. Okay. Um, after you, you say the word I, Yishja Akashi Eya, Nihiji Dibe Atehata Dotze Hishja, Aro in the Eya, Ashe Kekaho Eya, Yadatio E, Kut A Eya, the Oath of Office, the Dadil Nihishja, Nle to the Office of Eshe Ade Eya, Navajo Board of Election Supervisors. A hot a ya bet a bet a dot chi hisha, a ron da a yan le oath of office a deal so a tota deal ni hisha. Can you please raise your right hand? And this is the oath of office for all of the elected officials for the Navajo Nation. I state your name. Do solemnly swear to uphold and abide by the laws of the Navajo Nation and the Treaty of 1868 between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America and will faithfully execute the office of the Navajo Board of Election Supervisors And will, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the laws and government of the Navajo Nation and advance the interests of the Navajo people, having due regard for the ethical duties and responsibility of the office. So help me God. Congratulations. I do connect the Nana Kahadi Eya, the Navajo Board of Education Nihi. I connect the Nata Zito and the Koto Eya, Oath of Office and Nada Didli. Please raise your right hand, Shnajabayatatoshni. I state your name. Do solemnly swear to uphold and abide by the laws of the Navajo Nation and the Treaty of 1868. Between the Navajo Nation in the United States of America and will faithfully execute the Office of Navajo Board of Education and will, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the laws and government of the Navajo Nation and advance the interests of the Navajo people, having due regard for the ethical duties and responsibility of the office. 
So help me, God. Congratulations. Tagon at Danana Kadi e ya school board. Can you please stand up and raise your right hand? Okay. The school board, Danoshinidi, um, from each of your communities, um, when we get to the office of the school board member, you'll state your own community. I do solemnly swear to uphold and abide by the laws of the Navajo Nation and the Treaty of 1868 between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America and will faithfully execute the office of a school board representing and will to the best of my ability preserve, protect, and defend the laws and government of the Navajo Nation and advance the interests of the Navajo people. Having due regard for the ethical duties and responsibility of the office. So help me God. Congratulations to each and every one of you. Then the next group is just the last one on um, the Navajo Kienta Township and Nash Chidi Commission. Can you please stand up? Okay. Please raise your right hand and say the word I and state your name. I. Do solemnly swear to to uphold and abide by the laws of the Navajo Nation and the Treaty of 1868 between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America and will faithfully execute the office of and will, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the laws and government of the Navajo Nation and advance the interests of the Navajo people, having due regard for the ethical duties and responsibility of the office. So help me, God. Congratulations to each one of you. Everybody look this way. Navajos look this way. Don't mind what's going on over there, but those that are sitting up there, please make room for a public safety to do what they need to do. 102, please. Navajo 101, <laughs> All right, we're going to... Now for the moment we've all been waiting for. Ladies and gentlemen, how many of you are ready to witness the oath of office? for the Nigran Montoya administration.
and also the 25th Navajo Nation Council. This will be done by the Honorable Chief Justice of the Navajo Nation, Honorable Joanne Jane. Would you please raise your right hand and repeat after me? I, I, Doctor, Doctor, Nigrin, Nigrin, do solemnly swear, do solemnly swear, to uphold and abide by the laws, to swear, uphold the laws of the Navajo Nation, and the Treaty of 1868, and the Treaty of 1868 between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America and will faithfully execute the office of and faithfully execute the office of the president the president and will to the best my and to the best of my ability and to the best of my ability preserve preserve protect protect and defend and defend the laws and government and the laws and government of the Navajo Nation of the Navajo Nation <clears throat> and advance and advance the interests of and ad the advance the interests of the Navajo people the Navajo people having due regard having due regard for the ethical duties for the ethical duties and responsibilities of the office and the responsibilities of the office so help me God so help me God Ladies and gentlemen, your new Navajo Nation President, Dr. Boo Van Nigren, and First Lady of the Navajo Nation, Jasmine Blackwater Nigren. All right, next up will be the oath of office for the Vice President of the Navajo Nation. Please repeat after me. I. I. State your name. Rochelle Montoya. Please take. Do solemnly swear. Do solemnly swear. To uphold and abide. To uphold and abide. By the laws of the Navajo Nation. By the laws of the Navajo Nation. And the Treaty of 1868. And the Treaty of 1868. Between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America. Between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America. And will faithfully and will faithfully execute the office of Vice President. Execute the office of Vice President. Woo! And I will, and I will, to the best of my ability, to the best of my ability, preserve, preserve, protect, protect, and, and defend, defend the laws and government, the laws and government of the Navajo Nation, of the Navajo Nation, and advance the interests, and advance the interests of the Navajo people, of the Navajo people, having due regard, having due regard for the ethical duties, for the ethical duties and responsibilities of the office and responsibilities of the office so help me god so help me god Najona yet ladies and gentlemen the first
first female vice president of the great Navajo Nation, Honorable Rochelle Montoya, and second gentleman, Olson Chi. The oath of office for the 25th Navajo Nation Council. Would you step up to the podium? Also done by the Honorable Chief Justice Joanne Jane. Everyone raise your right hand. I, I do solemnly swear, solemnly swear to, uphold to uphold and abide by the laws of the Navajo Nation and Treaty of 1868. Between the, Between the Navajo Nation and the United States of America. And will faithfully execute the office of. And will faithfully execute the office of. And will to the best of my ability. <laughs> Preserve, Preserve, protect, and defend, protect, protect, and defend the, laws the, the laws of the government of the Navajo Nation, of the Navajo Nation and advance the interests of, the, interest of the, Navajo the Navajo people, having due regard, due regard for the ethical duties, the ethical duties and, responsibilities and responsibilities of the office. So help me God. So help me God. Ladies and gentlemen, the 25th Navajo Nation Council. Let's hear it. Navajo Nation, here is your new leadership. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. How about a round of applause? Thank you, everybody. We're going to keep the program moving. So please, please uh, go back to your seats. And now, this is a moment that all of you have come here today for. I will be introducing our new president of the Navajo Nation. Please be seated, everyone. Thank you very much. We're going to keep the program moving. Uh, after. After. Please be seated, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to swiftly go through our program and finish out. Kodoshi, uh, Victor Begay, Kodoshi Honor Song. Mr. Victor Begay.
In April 2022, I had the distinct honor of introducing Chiyaj Dr. Boo Nigren for his candidacy for the Navajo Nation president. On this historic day, I'm even more honored and proud to introduce him as our next president of the Navajo Nation. I will begin like this. Once upon a time, there was a young boy growing up on the Navajo reservation. He was born on a snowy day. He was born into a single parent home to a young mother who was 15 years of age at the time. He did not have the opportunity to know his South Vietnamese father, who was a refugee. He lived in a 10-foot travel trailer with no electricity and no running water. He struggled to learn English in school, and he did his homework by a kerosene lamp. As a young boy, he went to Farmington with his mother to sell jewelry and restaurants to help pay bills for his family. He was often rejected by non-buyers. At age 13, he learned carpentry and built a storage shed, an outhouse, and a doghouse. He lost his beloved mother to an alcohol-related cause, and he was raised by his grandmother, who is with him here today. The story gets better. In school, he would look at pictures on the wall of leaders. Even while he struggled and failed, he heard their ancestral voices. These voices propelled him to graduate from Red Mesa High School as class valedictorian. And a recipient of the Gates Millennial Scholarship and the Chief Manuelito Scholarship. He received his bachelor's degree in construction management and technology and his master's degree in business administration, both from ASU. And a doctorate degree in organizational change and leadership from the University of Southern California. As a young, intelligent person, he successfully worked in the private sector and married a beautiful young lady, Jasmine Blackwater Nigren, a graduate of Stanford University, an attorney, and she served as Arizona State Representative. With his talented hands, he built at home, a home at Red Mesa for his family. And together, they had a beautiful child. So what is the twist to this promising story? How did it happen? Somebody believed in him. Maybe it was a teacher. Maybe it was a coach. Maybe it was his mother. Maybe it was a leader like former President Joe Shirley, who in 2018 asked him to be his running mate for the president of the Navajo Nation. So in 2022, he made a decision to run for president of the Navajo Nation. He knew it was going to be a challenge to go against 14 other candidates who were well qualified, and many of them were women. He also knew it was going to be a challenge to change the trajectory of his predecessor, President Jonathan Nez, who stood courageously to save his people from the terrible COVID disease, which infected more than 80,000 people <laughs> and nearly 2,000 people died. You have done for the Navajo Nation and the Navajo people, and we continue to wish you much success. So. Let's give a huge roar and round of applause for President Jonathan Nez.
Thank you, President Nez and all of, uh, President, Vice President Lizer and uh, President Shirley Shiche, Kihat, President Ben Shelley and Chairman McDonald Shiche, Ate. And thank you. And also, we campaigned on how do we combat the everyday things that hurt and go up against our people like poverty, hunger, thirst, sickness, old age, greed, jealousy, and laziness. Those are the things that we have always heard for many, many, many years and that continues to mess with us. But I know one of the things I've always said from the very get-go is I'm looking forward to working with the 25th Navajo Nation Council because one of the things I've always said is a united Navajo Nation leadership is going to be strong, it's going to move things forward, and we can stop talking about the basic needs of our Navajo people. So I look forward to every individual up here, the 24 Navajo Nation Council, because we have one mission. Let's get basic services to the Navajo people. We need water, we need roads, we need broadband, we need better public safety. So as your next Navajo Nation president, I will not hesitate. I will do whatever it takes to make sure that our people have a chance, our people have an opportunity to make something of themselves. That's all they want. The reason why I say that, as Shema mentioned earlier, growing up in those conditions, somebody had to believe in you. As leadership sitting on the stage, we believe in every single one listening back home, listening from schools. Some of them have traveled from the, the school I attended, Red Mesa Unified School District, Kirtland Central as well. And thank you, Window Rock Scouts, for everything that you do here. Those are the people that we're thinking about. So as president, my decisions will always be very simple. Does this move our nation forward? Does this get out of third world poverty conditions? If yes, so be it. Let's go. Let's make it happen. Because we have 50% of our people that are ready to work. I'm tired of hearing about unemployment. 50%. No. But we have some of the best people in the world. Educated. Lawyers, attorneys, doctors, carpenters, welders, plumbers, electricians and entrepreneurs and business owners. So it's about time we believe in you and this administration is gonna be about you because we are tired of moving off the Navajo Nation. It's about time the grass is greener on the Navajo Nation. So, and those are some of the things that I will focus on. As you've heard me over and over again, I will champion the basic needs of our people. I will champion. I will make sure your voices are heard on a daily basis that the people living in poverty, the people with terrible washboard roads, the people that call the police and it's six hours, ten hours the following day, those are the people I truly want to help them. Do you know why? The reason why I say that is in order for us to have a strong economy, in order for us to have a strong Navajo Nation, let's stop thinking about how do we survive. Let's get out of survival mode, and that's what the 25th Navajo Nation Council, myself, Vice President Montoya, that's what we're going to focus on because People like you believe in change, and people like you want somebody that's going to challenge the status quo, and that's what it's all going to be about. The other... I know I had a whole speech. I kind of went off the other way, so don't mind. Let me scroll a little bit so I feel like I'm, I'm staying on track. But anyways, I, wanna, I also want to say... One of the core values that's going to guide the Nigerian administration is going to be competency. As I've said time and time again, we want to work with people that know what they're doing, that are willing to constantly learn, develop themselves, continue. The ones that fell off the stage, the ones had, that had setbacks, those are the people I want to work with because they know what it's like to fall over and get back up and keep moving forward, right? And a lot of us come to those situations. Not all of us hit something perfect the very first time. 
time and time again, some of the teachings you the, the elders have always told me, hindi ne, haise bin yesen tke, to naat zago, haise bin yen charo le, hindi ne, ha jobin tka ho nasko na na ta, eh, ahot enigin sa ha kesiki, that's what we're gonna use. I bring basic leadership. As mentioned before, one of my first projects with my uncle, he's sitting in the crowd here, building a shade house, a, a storage shed, an outhouse, a dog house, building a skate park, learning how to weld. Those are the basic things that I think about. Sure, I might have an MBA. Sure, I might have a doctorate from the University of Southern California. That doesn't matter because most of our people just want basic leadership so that we can get out of this rut. Let's not make things complicated. Let's simplify things. And one of the things I promise to you is if the president of the Navajo Nation goes to jail for bringing water to its people, so be it. Why not? We need gravel pits. I hear $3 million a mile. You can't even build a $3 million a mile road in the, in the Phoenix metropolitan area. It might be made out of gold if it's $3 million a mile. But on Navajo, that's the reality. $3 million a mile. We need to come up with innovative ways to have our own gravel pits. Let's bring it from $3 million a mile to $2 million a mile. Let's make sure that there's more broadband towers across the Navajo Nation so that when public safety and first responders need to get somewhere, it's the, the broadband is there for them. Simple things like that. Broadband that will help our kids that are living at home and being with grandma and grandpa that need a mentor. Because right now you travel across the Navajo Nation, you lose service. The reason why I'm here today is because I've had good people that believed in me. Why not connect our young people with good people from all over the world that will mentor them to be the people that they've always dreamed about? So those are the things I think about as becoming your next Navajo Nation president. Bigahya. So, again, it's going to be a long journey, but I know one of the things that I mentioned earlier. Surround yourself with good people that have knowledge, that have wherewithal, that will continue to learn. Number two, work with people that have a heart to serve our community. So as president, I know all 7,000 Navajo Nation employees are listening. I urge you and challenge you to work with me and I'll work alongside you. Let's continue to bring better service that's more efficient, more effective, so that they can get the services that are needed. And I will be there. I want to listen. I want to know what the struggles are. Let's work on that. Let's refine the plans of operation. Let's regenerate laws that will make things happen by working with the leaders behind me and so that we can get you basic services on a daily basis. That's what I say when I say compassion you got to love your people. That's why we're up here. Every 24 delegates up here, myself and Vice President, we love each and every one of you, and we are going to do what it takes to make sure we get you basic services. And teamwork. I know teamwork sounds very simple. But it's going to take a lot of teamwork. For years and years and decades, we've always had a divided Navajo Nation Council, a divided office of the president and vice president. Why not unite and stand up so when we have a strong Navajo Nation, we can get past the basic services? So 20 years from now, our nation will be thinking about how can we have a greater GDP than California? We are the trendsetters in the United States of America. We are leading in every sector here on Navajo. Opportunities are better on Navajo. I love working on Navajo. And that's what it's going to take with the 25th Navajo Nation Council and myself, Yedes Khan and Sakes. And I look forward to helping you and serving you as your next Navajo Nation president. And I am very honored to help and represent all 400,000 Navajo people, all 110 chapters that you all voted on. So thank you, thank you so much. And thank you, thank you, and God bless the great Navajo Nation. How about a round of applause for your new Navajo Nation President, Dr. Boo.
Lightgreen. Ay, ado kodon hinantay. I want to recognize the women on the 25th Navajo Nation Council. If you would move forward so we could honor you. Your women council delegates for the 25th Navajo Nation Council. Nine women on the new Navajo Nation Council. Come on, woman, make some noise. Okay. Ado, if my sister can move up so we could recognize her as well to stand by the Women Council delegates, the first female Dene Asane Vice President of the Great Navajo Nation, Rochelle Montoya Chi. Come on, one more time. Let's make a round of applause. Thank you. Yeah. You may be seated. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, ladies. Ado, following the, I guess, uh, council, you are dismissed to sign your paperwork and work for the people. Hiya ba hida kadia, the 25th. Navajo Nation Council. All right. We're not done yet. Don't leave yet. If you leave, you're not going to eat. Just kidding. Kodo, <laughs> all the way from the Northern Navajo Agency, out of beautiful Shiprock, New Mexico, Help me welcome Natani Nez Singers. Kodosenza Nahande de Do Us. Right after that, we will have the Honorable Former Navajo Nation President Shuche Dr. Joe Shirley Jr. to sing Navajo. Number one nation. Chaye kodos and nechanda dot ahya ah do in da kodo na da isanil zanto leh. Remember that we have some festivities celebrating today's event, all in Winter Rock, Arizona, at the Navajo Nation Fairgrounds. There will be a gospel event, also a powwow and gourd dance, and also a luncheon there. Help me welcome to the stage Natani Ne Singers from Shiprock, New Mexico.
Reserva. Maia by Hidak Kadianat Aninez Singers. Adults Hodo Shudane. We are not done with the ceremony just yet. We're going to turn the floor over to the Honorable Dr. Joe Shirley Jr. Should she to come on up and sing Navajo number one. Nation. Hiya, Nakinant. I buy Kadakadia. The Honorable Joe Shirley Jr., former Navajo Nation two term president. Kodosanya Hatrato Le. Okay, Victor, come on. Come on.
How about a round of applause for former Navajo Nation President, Honorable Joe Shirley Jr. Yeah. Sound man, if you can turn me up in the monitors just a little bit. Check, check, check. Thank you. All right, good. We're going to turn the time over to our former Navajo Nation Vice President, Myron Lizer, and the Second Lady Dottie Lizer to come and present a gift to the new administration. Help me welcome the Lizers of the Navajo Nation to come and present a special gift to our new administration. Remember, the gospel celebration will start at 3 o'clock to 6 o'clock at the powwow grounds on the Navajo Nation fairgrounds. We'll have uh, Pastor Wallace Begay, Evangelist Harrison Mann to do the service there honoring the new administration. Also, song and dance celebration will start at 1 o'clock this afternoon. Comedy show, 1.30 to 2.30, 2 featuring uh, Ernest David Sosi III, Lainey Pablo, a.k.a. Sistar, Chizba and the, at the Navajo Food Pavilion starting at 1.30. Honor Gourd Dance, 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. The inaugural ball tickets are sold out, so thank you. We also want to recognize and let's make some noise for all our viewers via telecommunications through the internet on the World Wide Web. Over 3,000 viewers that could not be here today. Let's make some noise for them, Navajo Nation. Here is the presentation from former Navajo Nation Vice President and his wife, Myron and Dottie Lizer. Power tools. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, yat a shay myron lizer in this year. Comanche in this lead. Toil on a bus's chin. Though Comanche does a che. Asha does an alien. Thank you, one and all. This has been a great four years. I appreciate all of you. We love you, as President Boo Nigren says. Doesn't that have a nice ring, President Boo Nigren? So we appreciate his leadership. And we're going to go ahead and gift him. A little something, something from Dottie and I, the second lady, but my first lady. But we appreciate you all. I hope you had a grand time. Thank you for the last four years. you. We love you. We'll see you on the highways and byways. Ahiala. We're going to do the benediction. If uh, ladies and gentlemen in the audience could please give some uh, time and reverence for prayer. And then we're going to do the retrieval of colors by the Denesani Salatso after the benediction. Please, ladies and gentlemen. So, so the Zinbecha Atzi. Stephen Benali, traditional practitioner, Hakoya. So the Zin Kodobe, Alche So, all our non Navajo visitors, non Navajo speaking, please, if you would give reverence and time to our traditional practitioner to say the benediction for today's ceremony. Please, for a few minutes. After the benediction is done, there'll be the retrieval of colors, so please have respect and show reverence at this time. Oh, yeah. 
ဟာရှင်စကီလာနော်စီနဒင်လာထရာဖိကအခေရှလာစတီတော်လေလာနော်စွန်ရှင်ဘနီယာအာဟိုတဲ့အင်တခွဲဆော်ဟိုတစ်
Nikina Tani Ko Nahoti Tati Saa Kos Zentoldosh Ikhe Tati Akot O La A Let Adol Ko Lej Besa Itle Besa Ditle Shahot En Joko E Ado Noho Ra Ado Ned Aha Chichitol Was Nahabi Yet So the Zebigate Dishi Ebishi Ako <laughs> Was so the deal sich so de sin wel so ho kose da be jo bei noch sin it o be ba hat it se di de ko hinase banat a we so de sin begin ko de ho jo do le no san nicht ma ja de sich nicht tra nicht je den den san da rebe ge ho jo ho jo do le di je ko de ke ja has aber ka i di ko e e ho wan san an ge be je do be ni do when ye holo ko e ki khidi je ya te ko hojo ko dige ko en ha han zin do le ha in zin do le do ni ko so de zin ben je ha o zi ko e ha hal je sha ta a de ke da hona a be ho je sho kun za ho be ho ji a ke la di je ko e o a a sin a bi ge je na we ni ya jin zu in sho sha un sin a ke ho ni zin hojo ko je ha si do le so de zin Di ko hina hina pete ye ya e kuje le ya ash ya kashpa no san kuje dobeni ohi atsa ki yande ke bol ya ki ayash na tan hujong ko be hasi dole di chini do ko ho aigi di na tan ni ke ke ya di ni ke ta sa at ne be ke ya na sti le ni ke na hente. I do when he's a honey yay. Edo, I don't die this this son, says not since or this dog or sleep depends her. The sound this is a soul, eh? I don't because you have your cars no hotel is no hot such a hash here. A big a hock hunter, yay, tan, shark, a hena hot list. I don't be a coe, yay, better has lag or could you in sarcas not had I in Nabe how did he beneath you quite the nan hit that nego? How did she suck her head in in it? Nihizad be Kyansen, his sort of Zimbe Kyansen, Nikhet Sospen Kyansen, Niyajin Tune away, Niyajini, Tligo Hunzate, Kehuit Enko. Ha, Deshin Hodeshis, and no Seth Hodeshis, Dunt A. Big Echo the Hot, Edo Big Echo the Hot Zaki, for the whole Jishi. Quinza the whole Jish, a quare, the Jacoba Hot Jis. D. The Conscious Tusha away. A large the Nebenant are the bills. Nichede, but I had nil. A bold town share. Bigger has zero bar joe, but no bar half in Zendo. Yat echo cabbage or needle. Yat a hegit a yapes pitch a bed so ho cost. A she bold town. A dee jacodo, bananish desire how to all this. Is card on lane desert. Don't lay chit into a do chit or dance. Sh a key into a hold this lego. Hashins had a hat at a desti. A rah at the dosja. I don't the day be sahot on nisi. Nijonoko be when seconds be holland or less. But jay be holland or less. But sees con ye had that a. A baby who ye la, da ho de yin de, bike ho ye la do, bike ho yin ti do le, bike ho chit li do le, ya se tsui bit o ni do le, ah, tsko je, ko je, be tse je ho jong go na ga do le, bike de ho jong na ga do le, be ya ge ho jong na ga do le, bike ge ho jong na ga do le, be na da tsko ho jong na ga do le, be za la tkha ha ho jong do, sa an a gai bike ho jong do, te del ne tse tke, li do le, ni ki na ta ni lo, Lego hashi ne hol yego and lego, but hold the stole. Daho de yende, because ye ladole, the yendahalonde, the yendahana, the yit 
ตะเนตะฮลอนเดบิกเฮยีลาดอเลวาฮุชินดอเลฮุจงโกเปสเนคไคดอเลฮุจงโกเปสเนลเตดอเลอาคุยจินขบาอันซินขบาจินปะดอ
the Nessani Salah so color guard. Nich at the Holoni, ha, ha, You could remove your headgear as we do the retrieval of colors. About a round of applause for the Nessani Sadatso Color Guard. This will conclude the 2023 Navajo Nation inauguration ceremony. Let's hear it for the new Nigrin Montoya administration, the 25th Navajo Nation Council, and all others, Navajo Board of Education, Navajo Board of Election Supervisors, Kayenta Township, Nahashchiri Commission, and the Plan 6 Navajo School Boards. We ask that you kind of uh, back away from the platform, ladies and gentlemen, as uh, Navajo Arts and Crafts Enterprise are taking care of their decoration. Please look around, take your trash. There are, um, there will be a meal at the Navajo Nation Fairgrounds. As we all know, traffic is probably not a We are more than just a college. Some say that we thrive off of challenges and failures, but we still have more room than ever to improve. In order to become the greatest of all time, we stick together and execute what needs to be done. We are more than just a college. We are a university. It begins from within.